We woke up really early this morning and took off from our area in Utah County and came to the southern tip of it. We're at Spanish Fork, we go up the canyon on US 6 and we came out here to Dry Canyon Road which leads up to Dry Canyon and Six Fork, Six Forks, Three Fork? Three Fork. Three Fork. This is Dan. Dan, he's the one who invited us out here to Fifth Water Hot Spring and we said yeah, we absolutely want to come out. And so we decided to take off this morning on Martin Luther King Day. and Yeah, I've been on the hike before um, a couple of years ago when it was summertime. And uh, it should be pretty straightforward from here. It's a pretty easy hike. My kids, was, my kids were little with me at the time, and they hiked it just fine. So it was, yeah. uh, It's a really mm -hmm. easy hike from the trailhead right here. In the wintertime, they closed the road down here by the campground about four miles away. So it adds an extra four miles to the hike. We decided to use fat tire bikes and a regular mountain bike today. And I don't know, do you hard. feel like it's a re regret doing bikes? The, the fat tires were a little tough. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's too packed down for them. It's been a little rough on me this morning. I'm laying down and three girls come passing by all chipper and excited. Hey guys, you gotta go up to the falls? Yeah, us too. Yeah. And uh, I just tried to pretend like I'm manly <laughs> and strong, but I, I, I barely could do it. They kicked our butts. Yeah. Yeah, they did. Even in the fast pass we had on the way downhill, we barely caught up to them at the trailhead and they took off ahead of us. So this is a bunch of hot springs, several pools, and they're really green colored and we can smell the sulfur already here two miles away from it. So we're excited to see what we can get around sunrise. It's a really cloudy morning. We have some openings in the sky. We're hoping that the sun can really peer through there and give us some diffused light. So we're gonna hope that we get some really good light coming through here, but it might just be really even light and cool colors and snow. And so that's still fantastic. We'll see what we can get. Probably close to a mile and a half so far. Hiking boots, and the 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 snow was so compact. It was awesome. We didn't have to snowshoe in at all. It was rad. Which looks amazing, and the water's all blue because the spring is just up ahead, and the water's nice and warm. So Dan's down there setting up a sweet shot. I'm gonna sit up there, over here, either over here or over here, and see if we can get a good uh, composition of that awesome little waterfall in that blue, blue water. At this location, I really like my shot. I at least like the potential of my shot here. You can see how I have the log that's awesome going across the rocks there. The water has this teal green, grayish green that's awesome. But look at this picture. See how kind of the feeling of my focal point of the log is lost. It's sort of blending in with the background and there's just, it's not breaking the plane. It has a bit of a tangent with the plane. So let's move around and see if we can find that better composition. Now up here you can see how I'm getting that color still. The log isn't in a tangent anymore. This might do the trick. Let's see what we've got for options. I hope you can hear me over the babbling of the spring, but this is 
almost there. Check out this shot. I feel like there's more magic in this shot than I had before, but I'm not, I don't know what it is, but I'm not fully satisfied with it. I'm not definitely there yet. Let me see if there's another option for me. Well, I don't know if I got it. I don't know if I got it. It's really difficult to say. There's too many elements in frame that I don't like that I'm being nitpicky. I see that I've exposed it. I've done some bracketing to make sure that I've exposed well. I've tried portrait, I tried landscape. Both orientations have really good shots. The pools are very photogenic, but I don't know if I found that shot yet. Check these out and let me know. I'll keep looking around. Hey guys, thanks for joining us in this crazy uh, hike we went on. Painful. And, uh, it's been painful, but hopefully the pictures turn out good. We'll show you on the video and uh, yeah, we, we're pretty excited about those. Thanks for following us guys. If you enjoyed this video, as always, please like and subscribe. We appreciate the support. Yep. See you next week. Yeah. Backed up there, a lot of people. Oh. Yeah, it is actually. There is actually. It's mostly guys, so you guys have a lot of choices if yeah, you're interested in so, guys. Right? Uh, yeah. <laughs>